So it's been about three years, not three years, uh, a year and a half since I've had this Echo Trimmer. So, and I have never had the plug out of it or the air filter. So, I went to Home Depot and bought a tune-up kit. I'm not going to replace the fuel filter because I don't, really don't think it needs it. But, uh, we're just going to replace the plug and the air filter and we're going to just, uh, take off the head and grease it a little bit. So, let's do the air filter since that's the easiest part. And as you can see, it is very dirty. But, it looks like it's been doing its job because this is spotless in here. Alright, let's open our kit up. Filter. I think this whole kit was like fifteen dollars or something, something like that. So it wasn't wasn't too bad, but uh, it was uh, it impresses there. Don't want to put that on there too tight because then you won't get it off. Okay. Looks like three quarter. Go grab a socket. It is like twenty something degrees outside, but the sun's shining, so I figured just open up the garage and hopefully the sun will kind of counter the cold. Yeah, plug. Let's see if y'all can focus. I don't know how well y'all can see that, but. There you go. That plug is pretty burnt, so it's a good thing that we're replacing it. I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, fire it up one last time, just put a little dribble of gas in it. So, uh, get the break in the plug. And it's been sitting for a few weeks. Switch on, joke, crown a few times. Alright, alright, let's see what happens.
something that I didn't get too long ago. Alright, so my grandmother got me this for Christmas. It's the new Echo PV2620 handheld blower. And I love it, so I'm just going to give it a quick start. I had it running yesterday, blow off the patio. Usually starts with like four. That's it for this video. Hope you all enjoyed it, and uh, I'll see you on the next one.